welcome back to my channel and welcome to another vlog. It is currently 1.47 in the afternoon and like I told you guys previously in all of my other videos and vlogs for this summer I'm trying to vlog as much as possible because during the school year I usually don't have much time on my hands to vlog. I usually only get like maybe one vlog up a month. So now that it's summer and I have so much more time on my hands, I want to vlog and I also want to be able to have these memories to look back on. So I'm trying to vlog as much as possible. So are you excited? So I'm going to vlog a little bit today. Like I said, it's already 1.47. I just pulled up to Target, no surprise. Um, I just need to run in really fast and grab a few things. I need to grab some essentials and also a box to ship out Lindsay's package because I'm a horrible friend and I still have not gotten my package out to her. So sorry girl, if you're watching this, I'm sending out your package today. So I need to grab a box to put all the stuff in. If you guys watched one of my previous vlogs, I don't know if it was a day in life or just a vlog, but it was one of the vlogs that I had a Dollar Tree haul at the end. I showed you guys these mason jar cups that I purchased for Lindsay because she was looking for it at her local Dollar Tree and she couldn't find them. I think she had only found one. So I told her I would pick her up some because I always see them at my local Dollar Tree. And I still have not sent that in. I think that was probably like two weeks ago and I still haven't sent it out because I have a horrible memory. I either would forget to send it out or it was raining and I'm too lazy to leave the house. So yeah, I'm going to send it out today. So girl, you're going to get your package hopefully in a few days when I send it out this afternoon. And yeah, if you guys don't follow Lindsay, I'll leave her link down below. She's really awesome. I love her. I met her here on YouTube and we became friends. She's one of the few girls that I have exchanged numbers with. I've only exchanged numbers with, I think, three, three or four girls here on YouTube. And she's one of the ones that I exchange numbers with. So if you guys don't follow Lindsay, her channel is Lindsay's Life and Style. You need to. She's awesome. She actually just uploaded today her weight loss journey video, so I need to go home and watch that. But anyways, I'm at Target. I'm going to run in, try not to purchase the entire store, and then I'm going to run into Dollar Tree. I told Ron he can pick something out at Dollar Tree, and I think I also might let the kids try a slushie today for the first time. I was going to go get some frozen yogurt because there is a frozen yogurt shop here in this plaza, but I think they have a slushie machine instead of Target. So. I think I might get just one for them to share. They've never had a slushie before. I've never tried one. So I thought, why not? It's summer right now. My car is saying it's 92 degrees out. So what better day to have a nice cool slushie than on a day that's 92 degrees outside. Anyways, this lady's staring at me next to me because she's parked and I'm talking to myself. So I'm just going to head into Target. Hi. Madison's in a pretty good mood. Maddie, hi. What are you doing? Are you in a good mood? Or did you know? do you just know we're going to get slushies? And Ryan's knocked out, so I'm going to have to wake him up. All right, guys. I'll try to vlog a little bit in Target and Dollar Tree. And then we'll see the kids' reaction to their slushie. Do you want to try a slushie for the first time? Um, yeah. Can I choose what flavor I want to get out of Okay, they have blueberry, cherry. They have a surprise one, which I don't know which one that is. And they have Coca-Cola. And then they have a lemonade one over there. So which one do you want? Lemonade, blue raspberry, cherry, or surprise? Um, I'll get out the cart. You want to get out the cart? Madison, which one do you want? I, 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 I Madison says she wants the cherry one. Cherry? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Mom. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. You want cherry and blue raspberry? Uh, mm, no, I wanted cherry and cherry and blue raspberry. And blueberry. Okay. Oh my God! I'm just like. Oh, well that's crazy. Taste. Great. Great. What does it taste like? All right. Let me let me let Cece get a sip. Let's see if she likes it. It tastes like soda. It tastes like mm. soda. You want? Oh, she's signing for more. Good job, honey. You want more? You like it? Okay, I'll get so you. I got a small one for Ryan, just when I was going to have him and Madison share, but I got him his own, and then I got a large one so I can share with Madison. Madison needs to stare on that brother, but you have some here. How do you like it? Is it yummy? It's a, I don't remember when last time I had a slushie, but we are in the dollar section. They don't have anything new in the dollar section, but I'm still going to look around and then 
grab what I need and leave. Do you like it? I think Madison says. Yeah. Madison says the plush is really good. Yeah, it is. First time having slushy, huh? So we are in the clearance section, and I was watching Joanna her Instagram little video on um, whatever they're called, and she showed what was at her Target, and her Target had much more. My Target barely has anything, and it's probably because I came later. But they have this little clearance section that I'm looking at, and I'm thinking about getting one of these. It's only six forty-eight was originally 13 I'm thinking about getting one of these and then going to Dollar Tree and getting like flowers and greenery to stick inside of it I'm not sure hold on and then um these little kitchen towels are really cute oh it's only one that was a set of two so this kitchen towel is only 210 I think it's a cute design and I also grabbed a water bottle you guys know I'm obsessed with water bottles so I found this water bottle on clearance for four dollars last time i came i grabbed one of these and i'm probably gonna grab that one as well but we're just gonna keep on looking around and then head out we've been in here for a while i was on the phone with my friend but yeah we're gonna go to dollar tree after what do you have on your head buddy pineapples pineapples you have all the fourth of july stuff out and they have but, pineapples yeah they do i think i'm gonna get this i think i'm gonna get the pineapple you're crazy I you think I'm going to get cute the headbands. And there's the emoji on and that. And so they have sparklers. Hey, I want to show you something. So much, right? I want to show you something really fun. What are you going to show me? Look, that sign is really emoji. cute. Look. Oh, those are emojis. Cool. Yeah, it's so and of funny. course, Madison always oh, needs to eat when we go to the store. Oh, yeah. Now, it's pretty crowded, so I only vlogged. Like, when we first walked in, to show you guys everything for July. We're in the toy aisle. And and Madison got cookies. And we're out of the way. Okay. You're gonna choose one thing now. So what do you want? Oh, but 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 all the but all of these are so cool. I know we can only have one. I told you only one. And I'm gonna pick up some more of these bubbles. I only see one. So I picked up this probably like a week ago for the kids, and it actually worked really well. So you know how the kids are always spilling bubbles. I found this at a different Dollar Tree and it worked. Like I tilted it over and no bubbles spilled out. So I'm gonna walk around and see if I can find another one. So I'm gonna grab this one because the kids love bubbles. Hopefully I can find another one. Cause that's the only one I see. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, look, look at him. This kid has so many stuffies at home and that's all he ever wants. All right, guys, I will see you guys back at home. I'll show you what I purchased from Dollar Tree. I didn't buy anything at Target other than a box. I was gonna get that water bottle, but then it was like damaged in the bottom. It was like bent a little, so I didn't get it, but we're about to go home. So I'll see you guys once we get home. Hey guys, so we are now back home. It is a little bit after four o'clock and I do have to run out again really fast to ship out Lindsay's box. I finally packaged it. I was planning on packaging it in the car so I wouldn't have to come back home and then leave again but I did not have anything to wrap her stuff in and I don't want it to break so I had to come back home. So this is her box and I need to go ship it out really fast. Before I do, just want to show you guys what I purchased from Dollar Tree. It's a very, very small mini haul. So first two things are these microfiber cloths. I love these microfiber cloths. I feel like they work just as well as any other expensive ones that you can find like at Target or Walmart. And I always use these and I ran out and then I couldn't find them for a while. My Dollar Tree just wasn't carrying it for a few weeks or a month. And then finally, I don't know if they just stocked, but I saw a bunch of them. So I grabbed two of those. And then I grabbed two of these push light LED manual lights. I don't know how well this is gonna work or if it's even gonna be bright, but I needed some of these. I need one for my closet right here underneath my stairs. It's like a little storage closet and it goes in really deep and it's so dark in there. There's no light in there. So I wanna put one of these in there and hopefully it'll light up the room a little bit. And so then the second one I wanna put in Madison's closet just because I store a lot of stuff in her closet as well and there's no light in her closet, really dark. So grabbed one of these for her room as well and hopefully they work really well. It says it's super bright, new and improved. So we'll see how well those two work out. And then I bought this Airwick stick ups. 
So I thought I would put one of these in our trash can in our bathroom and then the second one in Madison's little diaper pail because that diaper pail can get a little stinky. And this is in sparkling citrus. I didn't see any other scents. This was the only scent they have. Hopefully this works out as well. So yeah, I'm gonna put one in my trash can and one in Madison's room in her little diaper pail. And then I picked this Miracle Bubbles up. I already have one of these, but I picked up a second one because it works really well. So if you have kids, you know that kids are always spilling out their bubbles. My bubbles never last because my kids will use it and then the entire bottle ends up on the floor. Found this, this is a spill stopper and it actually really works. So it has a stopper right here that you screw on the top. And then if they try to pour it out or they drop it or knock it over, it does not spill out. I tested it, I put it upside down and I was shaking it and no bubbles was coming out. So works really well. So I picked up a second one. This was the only one they had left or I would have picked up more. And then I found this, I've never seen or heard of this. It's called bonbons. So it's kind of like when, you know those little surprise toys they sell like at Target or Walmart that it's like in a plastic little bag and then it's a surprise toy inside and you don't know what you're getting. Same thing with this. There's six different things that you can get. It says collect me over 100 styles. Okay, so there's more than six, but it has like six little pictures here. So you're going to get one of those little toys in there because that was really cute. So I picked that up for Ryan. There you go. So is he a toy for me? Yeah, but give me a minute, okay? You're and so I know I'm so nice and then I picked up this flashlight this car's flashlight for Ryan because he's scared of the dark and as of recently he's been really scared to sleep in his room he does have a nightlight in his room but I figured if he has a flashlight it might be a little better so just drop that so I got him a flashlight and then I picked up these pair of sandals they're really cute they have anchors they're blue and I thought I could just wear these around the house or when I have to check the mail or take off the trash or bring in the trash or water the plants, stuff like that. I thought I could just wear it. I wouldn't wear these like out and about because they are cheap and flimsy, but just to wear around the house or to check the mail, take out the trash, I think it's really good. And then the next thing I bought was this cute little patriotic bow. I was really wanting to get a 4th of July wreath, but I didn't want to spend a bunch of money and all the wreaths that I saw in the stores were pretty pricey. So I do already have a white wreath on my door. So I thought I could just tie this cute little bow on it. And then it has two little stars in the bottom. So I'm gonna tie this on my wreath on my door. And then the last thing I got was this really cute mason jar and it says vacation fund. And you can put a bunch of money and change in here. So I thought this would be really cute to put in my laundry room because there's always change in my husband's pockets or even my pockets sometimes. So I thought I can put this in the laundry room, just set it up there, and then anytime I find change, I can put the change in there. And that is, no, that's not the last thing. I have two more things. The last two things are these little love notepads. I thought they were sticky notes, but they're not sticky notes, but they're still cute. So this one has 50 pages and it says love notes. Thought that was cute and then this one i already opened because i put some in um like little notes for Lindsay in her package but it's just these little notes that say be still with a heart so i thought those were really cute they both come with 50 and for a dollar i thought that was a really good price and i like i said i did think they were sticky notes they're not sticky notes but i still like them now that is the last thing that i purchased from dollar tree now i need to go and run out really fast to fedex and ship out Lindsay's package and then we'll come back home and just relax. I know Ryan wants to play outside, but it's so hot outside. So maybe when we get back home, it won't be as hot. We can play outside for a little bit, play with some bubbles and stuff, and then. And then I want to tell you something, guys. You want to tell me um, what? Um, can we they can't see you. Stand up. Oh, you want to open it so yeah. they can see? Yeah. All right, let's. Um, I want to get the little cute little puppy. The little puppy. I don't know if you're going to get the puppy, but. Well, but, well I can get any one. They're all okay. cute. Okay, I'll open the plastic for you and then you can open the actual toy and see what you have, okay? Yeah. Right, let's see what he gets. So he said he wants, you want this one? That's the one that you're hoping for? Yeah. All right, so, so this I'm, is. I'm going to get, uh, uh, if they're, all, they're all cute, so I'll get any one. Dangerous <laughs> part. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. Anyways, guys, so that's the one that he's hoping for that he's going to get, but we will see what he gets. Yeah. Boy, your fart burn up and stinky. <laughs> Let's see what you got. If I can even open this. Okay, okay there you go. 
Now open it. See what you got. See if any up so they can see. Wait, wait, wait. I do. It's a surprise for them. Oh, it's a surprise for you guys. So, <gasps> what did he get? <gasps> Ooh, it's a turtle. I'll oh, it's squishy. For yeah. some reason, I thought they were um, like they were hard, like little toys, but they're not. Does it say that they're squishy? Let me see. Just says bonbons, collect me over 100 style. Hold on, unwrap it, it's a sweet surprise. It doesn't say that they're supposed to be squishy, but I thought they were hard. But that's still really cute. It's a, a little turtle, really bright green. He's squishy. There you go. And it came with a, where's that little tag it came with? Um, no, not that. This? Yes. And then this, I guess this probably says his name. Let's yeah. see, it came with this in there as well. So we're gonna open it and see what it says. And see what also, it has like a checklist. So if he wants to collect all of them, he can check mark all the ones he has. So, but one... let's check mark. Boy, okay, though. so you have Lime Layla. That is her name. She's right there. Lime Layla. So take the pen and check that one. And then the next time we go to Dollar Tree, we can pick up another one. And we. Can... Or how about we can pick out a whole and now pack he has, of them? Oh, this little egg now. Are you going to keep this egg or do you want me to throw it away? Uh, let's keep it so it can be his home. It can be his home? Yeah. All right, guys. So I am now going to head out to UPS, like I said, and I will vlog a little bit when we get back home. Maybe we'll play outside. I'm not sure. So hey, see you guys in a little. You record. All right, guys. It is almost 7 o'clock now. It's around 6.30, 6.40. And as promised, I told the kids we can come outside and play. I was hoping that by this time that it would be a little bit cooler and I feel like it's I feel like it's just as hot as earlier but no no, no don't eat the dirt Maddie um, but of course Ryan doesn't say no we're going outside yet we're going outside yet so we went to the UPS store or FedEx and we finally shipped out the package and then we stopped at um, Kroger I picked up some rotisserie chicken and also some sourdough sliced bread because I want to make some Cold chicken grilled cheese sandwiches for dinner tonight and then I picked up some more fruit because we go through fruit like crazy and that is it and now we're home the kids are playing outside we're gonna stay out here probably like 15 minutes because it's really hot and then head back inside to get a bath the kids already ate dinner though where's Madison there she is she's playing with dirt don't eat it though she loves to eat dirt though and there goes Ryan I, I was really hoping that it would be this sunny tomorrow. So we had plans to um, go to the pool with some friends. Madison, don't eat that. We had some plans to go to the pool with some friends tomorrow. That we're going to come over. But I checked the weather and it says 80% chance of thunderstorms. So I'm telling you, no, don't eat that. No, no. Oh my gosh, this child. Um, No, take that out of your hands. No, no. Oh my gosh. Look, look at this. She's trying to eat a rock. Um, okay, hey, if you're gonna keep on trying to eat that, then we're gonna go inside. Um, I, I, I just lost my train of thought. Anyways, like I was saying, we were supposed to have friends over tomorrow to go to the pool, but it's 80% chance of thunderstorms, so we can't do that anymore. Um, which sucks because I feel like every time we plan on doing something that has to do with outside, it always ends up raining. So, Florida is bipolar, it's beautiful out right now. It's so beautiful and sunny and then tomorrow it's gonna rain so we rescheduled for Friday as of now it looks like Friday is a good day to go it's only I think 20% chance of rain so hopefully on Friday we can go to the pool and hang out with some friends no Maddie this little girl I swear I gotta keep her in a bubble because if not she gets in trouble oh let me update you guys on the garden Ryan can you watch this see and let me know if she tries to eat anything um, our garden. So my husband had to put the pots like in the dirt. Let me show you guys. My husband had to put the pots in the dirt because the pots were getting too hot and they were overheating the plants. But we hey, have tomatoes. The, ba to the baby tomato grew up. It's huge. And then we have one behind it. And it's then big. in here are some strawberries. Oop. Yep. They're finally starting to sprout a little. I'm not sure if it's too late in the season for them to actually get strawberries. Madison, no. And then over here is our green beans. Yep, green beans. And then over here is another tomato plant. Mm -hmm. And there goes a tomato. 
And then the show of these plants. Whoa, and uh, these have gotten a little crazy. So we have the watermelon, cantaloupe, cucumber, and peppers. Madison, where are you going? Oh gosh, no, no. And she's off. Oh my gosh. All right, you, I wanted to show them the peppers, but now I gotta run after you. Here, let's go over here. One thing that sucks, since we don't have a gated backyard, um, Madison likes to run off, and there's like a cliff right here, and I'm scared she's gonna fall off the cliff. So let's bring Madison with us so I can show you the green pepper. The red peppers haven't come in yet, but there's flowers blooming, so let me see the green pepper here. Because Madison's needed. sitting next to me, I can show you guys the green pepper. But the green pepper is pretty big, so that's how big it is. We don't have any other ones. I had a fun time trying to see a fly. Remember, there's a spider web there you just went into. Hey, and she's off. Yeah. She's and Ryan said so he wants to roll down the hill. We have a hill right here. It snows, it's a really good hill to go. So sledding, or well, not sledding. Yeah, sledding. What happened? Where do you think you're going, Madison? You're gonna fall. Run, 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 Ryan, run. She's gonna get you. Hey guys, so I just wanted to jump on here really fast and end the vlog that you just watched. I did not finish vlogging the rest of that day because the rest of the night was pretty hectic and Madison decided to get into my makeup again. She recently got into my foundation and this time around she got into my lipstick. I had just taken her bath and she got into my lipstick it was all over her, it was all over my rug, it was all over everywhere. So I spent the rest of the night scrubbing my rug and taking her another bath, cleaning her up. And by the time I was done with all that, it was pretty late and I had to finish laundry. So it was just a really long night. So I did not pick up the camera again. So I just wanted to jump on here and end the vlog and say thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, remember to subscribe to my channel. And also turn on your notification bell so anytime I upload, you will be notified that a new video has been uploaded. And also give this video a big thumbs up if you're enjoying all of my summer vlogs. And we will see you guys in our next vlog. Bye.